fuel, but it's it's small and adorable. She is really focused. I know. She's like zoned in on the cereal. <laughs> My fat babies. I know. I think pigeons are growing on me a little. Only a little. <laughs> I don't know her name offhand, apparently. I have a whip wheel. I was doing one whip wheel. I got a point for a bunch of them. They're close enough for finishes for me to focus on. Oh. I used to have a whip wheel, but I got tired of adding whips to the wheel every time I had a new start. So I gave up. Every time. Like nothing else exists. I was nearing death, so I'm gonna roll off. Okay, Jay-Z. Thank you for hanging out. Let's her. Uh... I'm like feeling around to find oh I thought the cat woke up and was like under my desk thank you do you have to get more whoops at one time oh see I have like a master set of DMC that I will use for like I think most of my full coverage whips are using this master set of DMC and they're all just sharing it <laughs> Um, and I'll like replenish this, uh, the bobbins when they get low or when they run out. And I stole the idea from Stitch and Mo Sarah at Stitch and Monty because she also has like 50 plus full coverage whips. Um, and she, I think all of them are <clears throat> being pulled from her full cover, her master set of DMC threads. So it was like, it is honestly cheaper to just get a master set of DMCs and stitch them all because I like it's not like I'm kidding up a project and I'm going to finish it in a couple of months potentially, you know, like these will take years like, you know, months long is the minimum. These projects are going to take a long time, so I might as well just not like I don't need to get them up right now because I'm not even going to get to all the threads at one time and with full coverage you end up having a lot of leftovers because even if you have multiple skeins you're gonna have a lot left over of a single skein so that is very smart and i stole her idea but honestly it has saved my butt because now I can start a full coverage piece whenever I want as long as I have the fabric because I don't necessarily need to have all the threads to start it. And with full coverage, um, the dye lots matter a lot less because of the confetti and just because of the scope of the project. When it's finished, you're going to be standing far enough away from it that you're not really going to see a difference in the colors, even if they are, you know, the different dye lots are right next to each other. So I have a lot of whips because I can't, I have no self-control. <laughs> Here's the cabinet open and then get the bowl and cereal bag. Griggles, she runs really fast into position. Get a few done this month for the Stitch for a Pride. <gasps> yes. Yes, Jay-Z, don't push yourself too hard. You might, you might already be gone, but... <laughs> Tried planning projects and got so overwhelmed trying to figure out if I had the color or not. Yeah, I think uh, you can buy a master set of DMC from the website for like 250 US, which is a lot to drop at one time for floss. Like I completely understand. Um, and then you also need a place to store the floss. So you need um, like a container. I prefer bobbins for my master set because they're compact and just easier to like deal with and I use these um I have two of these like double-sided you see it's like double-sided